How's it going everybody? My name is Racky Mirror once again doing another Minecraft mod showcase. So today guys the mod that we will be taking a look at today is the Enderbrand mod. So essentially guys the Enderbrand mod adds in new mobs, new tools, new weapons and new armor into your Minecraft game. It is quite epic and I highly suggest that you guys stay tuned but other than that let's get started. Alrighty guys so we are back and now let's actually go ahead and take a look at what I was stating at the beginning of what this mod adds. So in the chest right here we we pretty much have everything that is implemented into this mod so let's go ahead and start off with the armor so in order to craft yourself the lightning infused diamond helmet and pretty much the other pieces of armor you're basically going to need lightning infused diamond now in order to get yourself lightning infused diamonds you're going to need five blaze rods and four blaze powders in order to create yourself a whoa need to go back here need to go back here in order to create a lightning infused diamond now the crafting recipes are basically the same as just crafting any regular old armor if you were playing survival or vanilla survival I should say. So we're going to put these away. Anyways guys let's continue on. So I already grabbed from the chest the new tool and weapons that are added into this mod as well the new mobs that are also introduced in this mod. So first off this is a... oh man I gotta get off a peaceful here. This is a ender zombie, which is basically a combination of an enderman mixed with a zombie, but of course it looks like it's more of a zombie than an enderman, it just has that enderman face, and it actually has a sword for whatever reason. See, when I hit it, it actually makes that enderman sound, but it also kind of sounds like a... kind of sounds like a zombie pigment also, and that thing likes chasing me. So I guess we're going to demonstrate the weapons. Basically, there's two types of weapons now. In order to craft the lightning bending diamond sword, you're just going to need two lightning infused diamonds. I already showed you the crafting recipe for that earlier. So, yeah, there's that. But you're also going to need a blaze rod to craft yourself a lightning bending diamond sword. And in order to craft a lightning infused diamond sword, you're just going to need six blaze powder, two lightning infused diamonds, and a blaze rod. Now, let's go ahead and test out the special effects. So, basically, with these swords, they're pretty overpowered, like, boom! Oh my god, that is really loud. They're both basically the same sword, except for the fact that one does more damage over the other, obviously. So, in order for me to kill the skeleton, I'll just kill him with the infused one. I'll just, like, spam the heck out of it. Oh my goodness. I didn't even realize this was like a ravine right here. Okay, so we kind of went a little bit crazy with him. But those are the two weapons. Now with the pickaxe, pickaxe actually still has the same, I guess, abilities, same effects. So let's go ahead and test it out on the skeleton. I don't... That was super loud. But I guess when you're mining, it's... Like, I'm kind of... Here, I'm going to go in game mode S. I'm going to go into game mode survival. Oh, I guess it's more of a weapon. Okay, I thought it was like if I mined some ore, it was just gonna, <laughs> it was just gonna start smiting the ore or something. I don't know. I was under some weird impression. Let's drop that coal, and let's also take a look at the Ender Spider right here. So let's spawn one in. Now the Ender Spider, as you guys can see, doesn't look too much like an Enderman. Obviously, like all of these don't look too much like an Enderman, but it has like half of its face looking like an Enderman. Look at that. You, you look pretty creepy, dude. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and take care of him with the almighty pickaxe. See? Nothing but ease. And lastly, we're going to take a look at the infected Herobrine. So let's just spun ourselves in the infected Herobrine. So this is basically the infected Herobrine. Looks almost like Herobrine with a little bit of Enderman infused into him. Hey, 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 Enderman. What the heck is that Enderman doing over there? All right, so I'm kind of tired of you. You're pretty, you're pretty intimidating, bro. What the? Holy crap! I just struck it once and then it just started spazzing out. Holy crap! All right, so putting all the stuff away in the chest, however, we are going to also just showcase the ores. So basically, this is the lightning-infused ore. So if you're ever mining with this mod. Basically, be on the lookout for this. Now, it kind of looks obviously similar to diamonds because I guess the creator of this wanted it to kind of insinuate diamonds, but it's kind of like overpowered diamonds. 
But in order to mine this, you're just going to need an iron pickaxe. I mean, I'm pretty sure that's common sense for a lot of you guys. I also love being interrupted in the middle of a recording. Okay, so let's just go ahead and get rid of these ores. Holy crap. This is actually pretty awesome, but that's basically all that this mod actually implements. It implements an enderbrine, also implements some new diamond tools and armor. It looks pretty badass. But anyways guys, I believe that's going to wrap it up for today's mod showcase. So if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like on this video, favorite, and as well subscribe for more videos like these. And leave me a comment in the comment section below telling me which ender mutation is your favorite one. Enderbrine, ender zombie, or ender spider. And be sure to leave those in the comment section below. But anyways guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.